Welcome to another 5 Minute First Impressions. I'm Anthony Malik on ReviewYour.website and today we're going to do ProsperityNinja.com. This is an effort to reach out to some of our uh, new Twitter followers, uh, brand new to Twitter, at AP Malik. Um, and this is uh, a website that belongs to uh, at NeverQuit99. Um, I saw it on their profile. It seems to be, I'm guessing, some sort of uh, internet marketing uh, campaign or website or blog or something along those lines so let's have a look okay so um, it looks like we do have images here that we're loading a little bit late and the YouTube video seemed to load a little bit late but that's okay uh, the first thing that's jumping to mind before I even read this is that your main banner is above your header here so there's definitely a problem there now I know people do try and break um, the horizon line to make things jump out at you but in this case it just feels off and it looks slightly amateur coupled with the image that we're using here in the header now this is an image that has a lot of text in it um, and it has a little bit of an interesting graphic and a, and a button here the problem with it is it's been compressed but quite lossy um, so we can see a lot of uh, kind of JPEGness going on around the edge here now it's probably just for um, you know lower bandwidth and stuff but the problem with that is it just makes your whole it, it knocks your whole website down a notch so especially for your header I would work on a, a higher quality image maybe a PNG which can be uh, uh, compressed quite well uh, without losing any quality like that or the other option would be to just have your graphic in the background um, to be an image and uh, your button and your text here could be CSS um, or, or just you know native web as opposed to an image so that kind of um, turns me off a little bit especially the fact that it's touching your member login button here uh, that's a little bit irritating I think um, however the alignment does seem okay everywhere else so far let's have a quick read simple three-step formula is a lucrative solution to a complicated online marketing world okay so you're selling your three-step formula uh, watch this video see the proof and look for the clock to hit zero so it's an internet marketing blog um, I'm guessing you're trying to so you're sell, you're selling your three-step formula that's pretty clear it's pretty easy we know what we're trying to sell I'm not sold on buying it yet though there's a lot of blogs like this out there and the quality of this website is kind of turning me off right now so there is a member login I'm not gonna click that right now we're gonna have a look down at the content a little bit more so I like the way you're going with your um, your picture here on top of your uh, header image it's kind of uh, Twitter-esque, Facebook-esque, um, YouTube-esque a lot of those websites are doing it uh, at the moment the way your layout is going right now it works in, in terms of actual positioning uh, I would get rid of this um, gradient on your navigation bar here first of all I noticed that it was an image when it was uh, when the website was loading but um, in this kind of in this day and age of flat design uh, gradients like that are just not cutting it at the moment and um, so I would simplify that however for um, you know for a website that that uh, you know seems the, well okay at this point it does look like it was kind of thrown together or has been online for quite a while however you've been updating pretty uh, recently and you've been putting a lot up there so um, there's no real excuse for that so we have a search bar. I wonder what we'd be searching. Probably blog posts. But we have your potential in 2015. Okay. And we have watch here. It's a video. It's in there. That's nice. Now, this little, the um, the gutter here between your content and your sidebar is a little bit big, I think. Um, I don't really understand why it's so large. Uh, you could definitely make a little bit more room for your content here uh, and, and push it closer. Maybe to make it even the same width as this vertical uh, here. But... Um, just something to keep in mind let's scroll down here okay so this read more button is uh, definitely needs a little bit of work I don't understand why the text would be that dark gray on top of that purpley blue color it just doesn't stand out well enough and um, I'd make it white I don't see why there wouldn't be what I'd also do is I'd add a, a subtle mouse over color change and um, just so I know that it's it is something and it, uh, that I can click on something that's um, interactive the final thing that I do there is I'd make it a line at the bottom with your social sharing buttons and um, I understand why you have your social sharing buttons there I've described my opinion on social sharing buttons on previous websites but the, the definitely the, the bottom alignment here is uh, is just not working so there's a lot of content here and um, but otherwise the design is pretty clean I'm a big fan of the colors so I hope this video was uh, useful to you thanks very much